Hi guys, Joko here. So for this video, I'm gonna take you through our process when we rehearse and how we prepare for a show. So it all starts here in the studio when we pre-prod for the tracks that we're going to use for our live set. So here I have Mr. Pawi Place Bass. What up? Yeah. He's gonna be helping me sa pag-prod ng mga synth, yung pag-setup ng mga session file for our live set. So yeah, we're gonna take you through how we do it. Yeah, so for tonight, it's actually the night before our rehearsal. It's already, ano oras na? Almost 10. It's almost 10 in the evening. And ngayon palang may magsisimula mag pre prod for the rehearsals and the show. But yeah, kaya yan. This yeah. is what we do. This is what we do. <laughs> yeah. So for now, uh, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna set up this GOC MHT6 for our live set. I'm gonna lower the action muna. It's gonna do last minute setups for rehearsal tomorrow. And Pawi actually be prodding, producing the intro of some of our songs. Yes, sir. Yeah. So yeah, um, we're just gonna play around with our Logic project and I'm gonna set up my guitar. So now it's gonna fast forward through everything we're doing right now. <laughs> Binali! <laughs> Yan pala, ka-video chat ko ang ating Pauline ko eto. Yan. Hello? Hi! We're pre-prodding for one of the songs that we're gonna play live. We're preparing the set list then for for the rehearsal tomorrow. Tomorrow? Yes. Uh. Yay! <laughs> so, hi Pao! Hello! Yan. She's gonna play with us in one song. Ah, ABC! Okay, oh, okay, yeah. okay. Yeah, so we're done uh, producing the intro for one of the songs. And now we're just gonna organize our set list with this Logic Project. As you can see, in this Logic Project, we already have the track set up. We have the intros, we have clicks, we have cues, we have extra guitars. Uh, if we need it, uh, we definitely need it because we're only gonna be a trio in the next shows. So here's how we set up everything. We have bounced MP3s of the banging track. So we have synths, bass drops, sub hits. We have extra guitars. We have double leads. We have extra leads, harmonies, and everything. We have everything we need here. So that's for our backing tracks. And as you can see, we have our clicks set up here. We have our cues whenever we need to come in, coming from intros. We have meta events. Uh, actually, these are important. Our meta event here is set up the way that it stops the playback of a song. Like whenever we need to stop a song for spills or anything. So yeah, that's our simple setup. Sometimes I put a limiter at this track for the backing tracks just to balance it whenever we send it to the front of house. And we actually have an EQ on the track so if we need to cut off some frequencies for the gig it depends on the venue so if we need to cut some bass we usually just touch the bass here for example if it's uh if the venue has very re reflective sound we just cut more of the bass yeah and everything's labeled properly and color coded so we wouldn't get confused and everything's tempo mapped it's everything everything's bpm sync so we wouldn't get lost. So yeah, I'm just gonna organize the session file a bit and we'll get back to you. Okay. Hi guys, so we're almost done with the tracks and we're just gonna wanna show you what we're doing here. It's actually something special and something kinda funny. Cause sometimes, uh, dun sa set namin, kasi Iba iba tuning namin. We go from drop D to drop C sharp to uh, dad god. And I personally sometimes lose track kung magtotoo na nawa or hindi. <laughs> so, ito yung linagay ko para ma remind ako na kailangan magtono. Magtono ulit kayo ngayon na blazing. <laughs> magtono ulit kayo ngayon na blazing. <laughs> yeah. So, yung lumalabas sa in ears namin. 
Ay, is a reminder na kailangan ko na magtono. Well, it's more for me. <laughs> so, yun lang. Just wanna show you show you guys that. But we're almost done with the backing tracks for our two shows. For May 4 and May 5. And it's actually 1.20 a.m. And we have a rehearsal tomorrow at 10 a.m. So, yeah. Here's what we do to make our sets extra, extra special. Yeah. Tapos mo na yun ngayon na please. <laughs> yeah, tatapusin na namin ngayon na please. So, we're gonna work on it pa ulit. Okay, so bye. Hi guys, so we're done fixing the tracks. Now it's already 1.37, but we still have to practice our parts. Wow! Yes, yeah, It's been a stressful week and it's been a busy week for all of us in the Jokoban. Yeah. But now we're cramming to practice because we really care about how we perform. <laughs> Hey guys, so kakatapos lang namin mag final practice for the rehearsal bukas. Puyat na kami ni Pawi, pero okay lang. Yeah, we're gonna wake up in a few hours. And ngayon, we're already packing our stuff. We've already bagged our guitars. I'll be using three guitars for the rehearsal tomorrow. Kasi I'll be using, I think, four tunings? Four tunings in the set. So we have three guitars. Ito yung bass ni Pawi. Here's my pedal board. Teeny, teeny, teeny board. And here's our in-ear system. So tomorrow at the rehearsal, we're gonna do a red rundown. And then, kakagaling lang ni Pawi sa banyo! Hi, <laughs> Jumibs! <laughs> We've already packed our essentials for tomorrow. So we have our gear, in-ears, and other stuff. So I have camera equipment, I have the laptop for the backing tracks. Uh, Ayun, Pawi stuff, and yeah, Nintendo Switch. Okay, so we're bored. Ano ba yung mga nalimutan natin? Sana wala. Oh, so, so far, okay naman tayo. Practice na ito. Okay, practice na kami. The backing tracks are done. Naset up na yung, mga, yung guitar. And, tumakulang natin. Tulog. <laughs> Yun lang. So, we're gonna continue this tomorrow. And hopefully, we'll have a really wonderful practice. So yun, hindi pa kami makatulog. It's now 3.22. Pa kami makatulog. And we need to wake up at around 7 because we need to leave at 8. Dadaan pa namin si Pao for our rehearsal tomorrow. So yeah. Yeah, yan si Joko. Nagkaano pa siya. NBA. Ayun, I'll try to sleep again. You say, ano, you say goodnight, Joko? Good night. <laughs> Nanggulo lang ako, kinuha ko lang yung camera. <laughs> Ayan, ako siya. Good night. So, uh, we're on our way to the studio na yung weird house ko. Hi, Pao! Hi! Hello! Familiar yung camera? Ah, ah. Ito yung banks ko, hindi nakaayos. Hello! Hello. Baby, say it! So, malapit namin sa Sagiho. Actually, we're here na. Berlin. Sagiho? Yeah. So, we just arrived dito sa studio. We're in the parking na Sagiho. Parang hindi ako sanay makita yung area na to na umaga. Katawan. Huh? Katawan, katawan, ang liit ni Pau. <laughs> Henlin. Show my show Pau. I'm here sa Tuto Astro Studio. Hi. Yeah. I'm AK. There's AK. Yes. The man. <laughs> yeah, and we're excited to hello, see the space. Oh my god, nandito na yung demonyo! Oh my god, hello! <laughs> so for more context, Jed was out for 10 months because he broke his finger. He wasn't able to play the drums. So this is the first time we're gonna play with him in a long, long time. God. What's up, vlog? Yes! Wait, try out my PS. PS5. PlayStation. <laughs> <laughs> so tagal tagal na hindi nag drums. Yun yung una nakita. Uy, PlayStation. <laughs> How does it feel to get behind the kit again? A PlayStation. Gabi ang sayo ng ano, ang ganda ng vibe dito. Very chill.
Hi guys, so just wanted to give you a run through no ano gamit namin ngayon sa rehearsal and ito rin yung gagamitin namin dun sa shows. So yun, start tayo with Mr. Pawi Table. Oh. Hi Pawi! Hello! This is my rig. Nalala ko si Tope eh. This is my drums. <laughs> uh, so, um, Cataclysm, Bass Overdrive. And then we have New X Yukio. Chorus. Pantuan Chorus. Yeah, Pantuan for <laughs> And solos. Yeah, uh, for solos. And Hikari Compressor. Yeah. So, yun yung pinaka. Okay. Then, here's my baby. No. So, nakita. Sire M7. Sire M7. Yeah, five string. Tapos, yan. Eye box dampers. Wow. Yan. Tapos, mousetrap. Mm-hmm. Yan. Shower out, Jello. So, ano yung usually yung pickups? Wow! Uy, ganda! <laughs> Ganing ganito ka, ano yung bass? So, ano yung usually yung pickup settings mo dyan? Kasi, kita okay. ka very complicated yung circuitry niya. Ayun, so, these two switches are for the pickup mode. So, ngayon, nakagitna siya. So, usually, nakasingle ako. But, for a bit heavier song, tataas ko siya. Uh, nakahambak or mode siya. So, that's Pawi. Now, yun, walk through naman kita dun sa rig ko. Ako naman maghahawak. So, for our set of shows this week, uh, I'll be using three guitars. So, we'll be using the, a lot of different tunings all throughout the set. So, we have a drop D, we have C sharp standard, we have Nad God, we have drop C sharp standard, E standard, so five tunings. So, spread out yan dun sa mga guitars. So, start tayo dito sa main baby ko for the standard tuning stuff, which is most of our songs. This is the GOC MHT6. So, one of the new ones from GOC. So, it's a material with a trem. It's an SSH and a S-style guitar. So, it's a pretty versatile one. Yeah, I'll be doing a demo of this soon. So, stay tuned to my YouTube channel. So it has a trim, a floating trim, it has everything I need. So this is my guitar for standard, standard tuning and drop D. So and all the accessories, we have eye box dampers, we have Pandipi strap, the Jordan Tasso strap. Yeah, so that's guitar number one. Guitar number two is this. It's the GOC Illumina 6. I use this for that god and drop C sharp. We have two songs that are drop C sharp and one song that's that guy, which is Love of Fake. So, again, it has equipped with high box stampers. Then, again, the drop strap from Pandipi Manila. So, yeah. And this really sounds super heavy and very punchy and super twite and very matapang. <laughs> <laughs> very matapang. Yeah. As you can see, pink, pink. And Here's a guitar that I haven't brought out in a long time. Again, so this is the Corona Modern Plus SE SSH. This is the C, sta- C sharp standard guitar. So it's like standard tuning but in C sharp. So it's kind of lower for one of our songs that we're gonna do. Yeah, again, we're gonna do a cover. Polyphias ABC, and so this is my guitar for that. We have an SSH setup, we have floating trim, two point trim, and check up with a DP strap as you can see here. And now let's go to my rehearsal rig, which is very simple. It's basically my live rig. So, this is the brains of my tone, the heart and soul of my tone. This is the new X Trident, it hasn't been out yet, but it's the new, new, newest release from UX. It has all the amps you need, really amazing amps. And since I don't really use an amp on stage or whenever I perform, the amp sims are really important for my sound, so it really does the job well. Like, since it's already running on PSAC 4K, you know, PSAC 4K amp modeling algorithm from UX. Yeah, it's, so the amp sounds are more realistic, it's more dynamic. And for monitoring, I'm going straight to the headrush. 
na FRFR112. Yeah, it's one of my my go-to babies for rehearsal. It's sturdy, it's really durable, and yeah, it's very light. So you just can fit anywhere, you just can grab it anywhere. Now let's go to the backing track rig. Okay. So here is our backing track rig, as you can see, as you can see, this is the session file we played around last night, and it's already organized with the set we're going to do it also. It also has the backing tracks, extra guitars, so it has synths, sub drops, sub hits, and the clicks and the cues and everything, and it's going to uh, Evo 8 by Audient. It's here behind the drum kit because the drummer needs hard line so it's an evo 8 yeah we're actually using all of the outputs here so we have an, an output going to the front of house and we have an output going to the drummer and another output going to me so we're well connected and well synced with a click <laughs> Thank you. 
Yeah, so kakatapos na namin mag-rehearse uh, dito sa Pluto Astro Studio. Super homie. Ganda kami mga artwork pa eh. Such a vibe. Dito na lang kaya ako matulog. Wala na bahay ko na to. Oo nga eh. This is where I live now. Yeah. The ultimate one. It's not Sagiho anymore. It's Paugiho na. Ang corny. So ayun, I'm with the owner of Pluto Astro Studio, si Sir AK. Ayun, hello. I'm good. Okay, okay, okay. 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 So aside from rehearsal studio, we have the yeah, we have we also have the recording studio. So, so maybe we'll start uh, target month namin on August. Makakarong uh, kumersa of opening for the recording uh, this July. So watch for it. Nice. And aside from yung space rehearsal space, we have the Ah yeah, production. we also have the Pluto Astro Studios na, na event. So sometimes dito kami sa Sagiho, of course. We have an upcoming event on May 17, and then we also have on June 22. So we have some plans. So we only we don't only we don't only accept rehearsal studios, but also recording and also production events here in Manila. So very one-stop shop. One-stop shop, and we also manage bands from Bicol. So now we have Pluto Astro Studios. Most ng mga bands na hinandila namin is from Bicol. So, Joko went there, so na experience rin yeah. yung, yung events and then yung uh, gig sa Iba Bicol. Iba energy sa Bicol. Iba, Iba. Grabe yeah. mga tao doon. Talagang... So, bumalik eh. <laughs> Oo. So, again, thank you. Thank you very Sorry, much. Guys. Thank you very much sa mga viewers. Yeah. And then, of course, the followers of Joko. Yeah. Almost a million, million and, followers ka na. Ano? Bakit 3 million? <laughs> <laughs> Peace out. Thank you very yeah. much. I hope na ma ma visit nyo tong Pluto Astro Studios. Second floor lang ng Sagiho Makati. Yeah. So yun second floor lang talaga ng Sagiho as in literal. Literal. Papasok ka sa loob ng Sagiho. So yeah. Um. Thank you, Alex. Sir Ike. Thank you very much. Yeah. yeah. So again, guys. Um. See you in the next gigs. <laughs>